Welcome to Yen's Yoga. Today's vibrant class are designed to especially teenagers to nurture compassion, confidence, and also a sense of belongingness. So we are here to release day-to-day -day sickness and then also bring balance between your physical body and also your mental state. When you're ready, see you on your mat. Let's begin with Barmanasana. Four limbs on your mat with hip circle clockwise and anti-clockwise five times in your own pace. Let the hip guiding you to flow as your arms and fingers are wide to support your balance. Slowly circling your hip. Notice how you feel on your arms, your shoulders, your lower back, hips, and your knees. Today's slow flow is going to teach us to surrender to the changes and promoting a love and positivity to our surroundings. One last time. On our next circle, we're gonna stay here. This time we're gonna balancing in Dandayamana Barmanasana. Left hip to the side of your mat, right hand to the side of your mat. Both limbs are 90 degrees. Hips over your grounded knees. Sit bone is lifted. Bend knees are in line with your hips. Toes together and point back. Shift to the other side. Ground your right hand. Lift your left arms. Ground your left knees. Lift your right knees. Staying here to bring the mental calm and gain your confidence for a challenging asana after this. Engaging your spine. Next, we're gonna do a vinyasa flow. Go to Adamukha Svanasana and Chaturanga Randasana or Vamukha Svanasana and Adamukha Svanasana. Slowly walk your hands to your feet. Come back up. Bring your bend your left leg. With your left hand, you're gonna hold your big toes. Left leg to the side. Uttita Hasta Parangustasana. Remember, if your minds wander, you will find it very challenging. So focus on your breath. Inhale and exhale. Left leg are externally rotate. Slowly bring it to the center of your mat. Now change the hand of your big toe. Right hand hold your big toe and left hand twisting to the back of your mat. Paribirta hasta prangustasana. The important aspect to keep in mind is the internal rotation of the hip. You will feel a stretch on the top leg and glutes. Come back down with control. Keep your left leg straight. Prepare for Balapurusva Bujadandasana. Right legs are over your left leg. Left hand in facing at the front. Right hand gonna pass to the front of your right leg and hold on your left feet. Next inhalation, you're gonna hinge forward and lift your hip. Engage your core as you squeeze your perineum and lift your hip. This pose can nurture the feeling and compassion plus your friendliness. Improve our focus and develop a confidence with a sense of belongingness. Flush out any unwanted energy. Slowly release. From here, we go to Vashistasana, left hand ground to the floor, both hip ass and shoulders are stacked together, right hand to the sky. We are 
facing the left side of our mat. If it is within your practice, hold your right big toe with your right hand. Vashistasana 2. Top leg is perpendicular to the ground. Hip are square. With control, bring your right leg in front of you. Find your balance for Parivirta Ashta Chandrasana Shepara Mudra Vinyasa. Index finger are pointed. Inhale up, exhale, chop to the side. Chopping wood. Inhale up, exhale two. Chopping again, three. One last time, inhale up, exhale, chopping to the right. Frame your front feet when we go for a vinyasa flow. Inhale, roll up, exhale, roll back. Adamoka Svanasana. Stay here, we pause. See how you feel. Is it very challenging? How are you controlling your breath? Couple more breath here. When you're ready, walk your hand towards your feet. This time we do the other side. Bend your right leg, hold your right hand with to your right big toe. Extend your leg to the right side. Putita Hasta Prangustasana. Active armpit on the right side while you're holding your big toe. Squeeze your hamstring, your quads, your calf, and your pelvis floor. Shoulders roll back. Slowly bring your legs in front of you. Change this, your hands holding. Left hand holding your feet front feet and right hand twisting behind to the right. Parivirta Hastam Hasta Parangustasana. With perseverance to stay in this balance, there is this scope of inward awareness of the principle of Svatyaya moving into the practice slowly. Now bring yourself all the way down, keep your right leg straight, left leg over your right leg with your left arm passing through the front and catch your right feet inhale it next inhalation hinge forward as you lift your hip bala prasva puja dandasana flushing out any unwanted energy and invite positivity Well done guys, from here, ground your right hand where they are and prepare for Vashistasana. You can support with a top leg or like me, if it is with me, you both feet are stacked together. And if you're up for a challenge as before, we we'll go for Vashistasana too. Top hand gonna hold your top big toe. Next inhalation, bring your left leg in front of you, frame your left feet, and we're gonna chop wood. This time, change your interlace finger. Inhale up, exhale, chop to the left. Inhale up, exhale, chop to the left. Back feet are active, arching, and point down. One last time. Inhale up, exhale, chop everything up, remove any negativity. From here, we're gonna do a vinyasa flow and meet me with belly down. We can prepare for Vimanasana pose. From here, we're gonna practice lengthening our spine. Which inhalations, we're gonna point our feet and lift our arm away from us again inhale lift exhale relax inhale push forward exhale relax one last time inhale push forward as you lift your feet and your arms off the floor 
shoulder are extend and scapula together. Legs and hips are hip width apart, 45 degree of the mat. Well done, guys. This is a great pose to eat to treat any irregular menses, balancing our throat, sacral, and solar plexus. Chakra help us to build a personal with of creativity and balance our emotions. Resting here for Balasana. Sitting on your heels, both arms extended in front of you. Without further ado, our favorite pose, Shavasana. I will call you when it is time. See you all again.